Welcome everyone. I'm going to take us through some vibrational healing and chant through the chakras. Now a little tip, you'll notice I've got a roll up mat in my hand. A little tip, most people have quite tight hip openers. So it's good to get some height underneath the backside when you're sitting cross-legged, and especially if you're going to be sitting cross-legged for any amount of time. You can also sit on a chair if you like, or any kind of arise. But usually in the yoga practices, I'll get people to roll up their mat. If you've got a really thin mat, you might want to roll up two mats. Uh, if you've got a thick mat, that's great. Great for this anyway. So I'm going to pop the roll up mat on the ground and take a seat on it. Now, of course, if it's more comfortable or if you have knee issues, have one or both legs out long, whichever you have the knee issues in. Or you can cross your legs. And you kind of sit forward a little bit on the mat. Because what happens in this position, especially if you've got quite tight hips and you'll know, because when you're sitting regularly, you're in cross-legged position, your knees will be really high. <coughs> so if you have that little bit of height underneath the sit bone, instead of being hunched over and like this, which is not good for your back, you can be nice and tall, your spine can be long and straight. Bring the hands into chin mudra pose, that's the point of finger and the thumb pad touching, back of the hands are on the knees. Sitting up nice and tall. I want you to find your breath in the diaphragm. So you can place your hand over your solar plexus. And most people, when they think about their breathing, they breathe up and down. What I want you to focus on is breathing forwards and backwards. Physically, you're not moving. This is just a visual. Just something to focus on. So as you breathe in, Breathe into the diaphragm and it expands. You feel your belly expand. Then as you breathe out, it deflates. And you might feel as though it's drawing back into your, towards your spine. So that's the focus with the breath. <coughs> and you'll need that when we're working through the chants. All right, so hands in chin mudra pose, sitting up nice and tall. Close your eyes, finding your breath. Now we're going to do three chants of each of the seven chakras and we're going to start with the base chakra. I'll guide you through it. So the base chakra, Muladhara, you might imagine in your pelvic floor a beautiful red swirling energy of light that emanates down into the earth. So bring that into your mind. And the mantra for the base chakra is the mantra of LAM, L-A-M. So let's take a deep breath in to prepare. LAM. Yellow 
flowing color emanating forwards and backwards. The mantra is Ram, R-A-M, deep breath in.
Namaste.